Hey there, it's Mark. Here I have the USA 2021 F case. This case has got some issues. When they cut open the case, or or I'm not when they cut open the case. But I don't know. It's got a big hole. It has a big old cut right here. It doesn't go all the way through. Maybe this one was on the outside of a pallet. Maybe this was like a piece of tape, you know, that straps all the boxes together. So they don't, I don't know. <laughs> so. That's one issue. The other issue, the bottom's fine as one single layer of tape, but on the top, it's definitely been resealed. The only thing is, the good thing is this seal, this is paper tape, is actually on top of this tape, and then the printing's on top of that, but then there's tape on top of it on top of that. Uh, it definitely has been cut. The first seal has definitely been cut because this piece of tape that comes right here. Let me get, hold on. Where's my, uh, I need something to wedge in there. Right here. Let me stick this in. So this one, look, uh, that first piece of tape has been cut and it has been resealed. On the other side, it's the same thing. Just to show you. Now, what does that mean? Wait. <laughs> what does that mean? I don't know. I don't know if it was I don't know if it was resealed at the factory or not uh, because that second piece of tape covers what appears to be the uh, factory seal. I don't know. So I'm just saying that up front. By the way, uh, well, let's just go. That's enough. <laughs> Last month, the E case was a pretty good case. Had some, oh yeah, this is another thing, as i seen this from the outside. You can see that white piece of thing. I don't know what that is. Very unusual. Hot Wheels, it says Triumph on there. Working project, you wanna see? Let me get it up close. I don't know if I can, yeah, we'll just pick up the camera, how's that? I'm not sure what that's for. Maybe somebody else knows. By the way, if you hear some squealing, I've been taking care of a stray cat and she had her kittens, if you want to follow along with the uh, kittens or our other cats, <laughs> you can follow along at the cats, the cats and moths, and that's where I keep I keep the cat stuff separate. Some people don't want to see a bunch of cat photos in their thread, and there we go. Now last month was a good month. This was a new model of the last month. It carries over to this month. You have the 67 Ford GT40, Mark, Mark IV. Love this car, love the GT40. So if you didn't get it last month, you got it here as well. I've been finding this mix at the Dollar Tree or at a dollar store. I posted a link, I posted a link on, uh, I mean, I, I uploaded a video on my Off The Pegs channel. Here's another one that was new last month in the E-Case Corvette. C dot R, and this is what it says on the back. This is the, this is for of course USA or English packages. So those were the two special ones from the last month. This model's brand new this month. We can go ahead and pluck that out right now. Ray, is that Ragen Express? Ragen, very cool. Uh, it's from the actual truck style called Decotura, where they decorate their trucks. So they add all these fancy things to their trucks. Pretty cool. And you know, it's, it's really neat to get Hot Wheels models that represent some type of car culture. Now this, this body's all plastic. This is all a Voom plastic. And it looks like it has a metal base. There you see Ragent Express. Production code N48. So it was made like early December. Let's see if it says Decotura on the back. I'm not sure. Yeah, sure it is. Sure it is says Decotura right there. You can pause it, let's move on. This is one of the new models for this case. There's actually three new models. They're all, they're all fantasy cars. Oh, that gasser's nice. They're all fantasy cars, but uh, that's okay. This was a new model last month. Twinin and winning. Twinin and winning. It's not and. So new for 2021. It had this information on the back. And we move on. Porsche. You have the 89 Porsche 944 Turbo. I like the, uh, this. to me, this is a Porsche. 
Nice, smooth, round corners. Yep, very nice. Here we have uh, Tread Shredder. Eh, motorcycles aren't exactly my favorite. I know some people like motorcycles. It's okay, buy what you like. It's up to you. Pretty nice coloration. Skinny wheels. It has its own type of motorcycle wheels. Here's two samples of the 2020 Ram 1500 Rebel. It's not a new model. Take a look. It does have printing. <laughs> it has tail lights on the corners there. And in the front, it gets some printing in the front. Now that I got the top row off, I can zoom in a little bit. This way I don't have to reach. I don't have to reach so far. Praying Menace in yellow. Here is Forward Force. X Racer. You can see right through the body. Plastic body. It's for the track, right? Tank Nader with that rotating turret. Mm, 2020 Jaguar F Type. New for 2021, but it's not the first color. Uh, blue, purple? I think it was blue. 2018 Bentley Continental GT3. I think this is the second color as well. I seen these at Target. I seen this one at Target. Mm, I didn't see that one. Velocity Racer. Fun stuff. As far as the decorations for the license models. Tail lights? No tail lights. This one got side decorations and top decorations. The Jaguar got headlights and tail lights. Here we have McLaren Speedtail. Love that model. Looking good. Uh, did get that great? Oh, look. Ski, look. It got tail lights right there. Nothing on the side. Nothing on the top. Oh, a little logo on the tip right there. And there's Grand Cross. And you also have no velocity. What's this one called? Formula, Gen, Formula E Gen 2 car. I haven't tested that one on the track yet. Grand Cross, another sample. Look how they have the track in the design. Pretty cool. See, there's the loop, best for track. That's not a treasure hunt symbol. That's a, uh, <laughs> that's a track loop symbol. There you have duck and roll, glow in the dark version, fun stuff. So see, that's the, that's the track loop symbol. If it's the treasure hunt symbol, it would be the circle flames. What? It would be that circle flame logo right there. That's the treasure hunt symbol. One per case. It might not be in every case, but it's only supposed to be in F cases. So it's kind of neat that I got a basic treasure in the case. It would be nice if I got a super too. Now, uh, supers are random too. Looking for special paint, rubber tires. Maybe it'll have a TH logo on the model. Here's the Hot Wheels Ford Transit Connect. It has had a casting change. I featured it on Mr. Grooves. You can find it in my casting change playlist, which is hosted on Mr. Grooves. 55 Chevy Bel Air Gasser. And it has Guster in the deco. If you don't know, that's one of my... Uh, Guster is that character right there. And it's from a game. It's from one of Mattel games. Mattel's games. Part of the Mattel game series. Here you have the 20 Jeep Gladiator in blue. I gotta get it. I have to use two hands. I bend my wrist back like that and then uh, too much uh, friction. Any, any printing? Any decos? Well, we got a skull right there. Part of the series? Uh, I guess, no, I thought it was X Games. Getaways. Oh, yeah, there is graphics. Gotta get closer up to see them. And there is Hot Tub. Oh, fell to the side. What is this? Mazda RX3. Basic white graphics. Get graphics on the top, graphics on the side. Mm, no decorations in the back. I like red, white, and blue. How about you? And no graphics on the in the front. You get it on the side and you get it on the top. Production. Oh, can't see. It's too hard to see production codes on a white base. Retroactive. Oh, nice. Uh, track design again on ret retroactive. Best for track. Corvette C7 Z06 or Z06 convertible and two samples. By the way, this was a Super Treasure Hunt last month. Now, the Super Treasure Hunt is like a special color. 
of a regular car. So it was this car, but it had Spectra Flame Black, special tires. Uh, I think it had a TH logo right there. But the, the basic treasure, I showed you that basic treasure. There, there won't, hold on. <laughs> I showed you a basic treasure. There will not be like another mod color of the basic treasure. It's that model. That's it. You don't have to look for special color or nothing. For the F case, you're looking for this. The, the good thing is in the United States, in the United States, we get uh, case code right here. I said this was the F case. So right there, there is F. So you know what to look for in the F case. You're going to look for that motorcycle. Tread shredder. And, and it's only one color. There's no like uh, special color. Twin in and win in. We already took a look at that one. Here you have the 2019 Kia Stinger GT. It almost has like that Spectre Flame Red color. Makes it look real nice. But this is just a regular car. Mass produced, just like the, as many as the other cars. It's not limited. And was this one in the last case? I think so. Thanks for letting me know that wasn't radioactive. That symbol right there is for the crash test dummies. Matter of fact, it says test market right there. Pretty cool. Fun stuff. Little Easter eggs, right? And here we have the GT Hunter in blue. Now, you know what? This actually was an ID car earlier in the year. I happened to get one in a case. I'm going to show it in just a moment. And then, or maybe I'll, maybe I'll show it after the break. I'll, I'll set it right there. Here we go. Here's a new model for this case. Custom small block. And uh, did I show this enough for guys? Toyota AE86 AE Sprinter Turueno. Now, by the way, I'm curious. Do you pronounce that AE86? Or do you pronounce it real fast? Like it's the number 80. 8086. It sounds the same. Anyways. Uh, some people like this. I got one in one of my cases... I don't know if it was this color. And this pillar was smashed. It was bent. Bummer, dude. So this is a new model for this case. And there you see. Look, you can put uh, bricks on top. Now, of course, they're not going to say what brand of bricks. They're just standard bricks. So uh, I guess uh, this part and that part pop off. Is that it? Yeah, two parts on top. So if you have uh, bricks, you can build it up and then design your own model. I don't know if you can put anything in the side. Uh, maybe you, uh, maybe you brick collectors, Lego and otherwise, maybe you post a comment. I read them all. Let me know if you have decorated any of the brick uh, custom small block. As a matter of fact, if you post a picture on Instagram, tag me, and then I'd like to see the customs that you've built, okay? 32 Ford. Dos. They already had one for Uno. Now we have Dos. Here is buns of steel. No more pipes in the back. Oh, it's still in the graphics. Why Why do they still have the tailpipes or the shakes in the back? Uh, baby ain't got no shakes. <laughs> Jeez. Do you think they'd fit somebody tell them by now? I'm not going to tell them. It's up to them to know. I'll show you the uh, Chase ID Chase after the break. When we look at these as well. This one right here. GT Hunter just came out of the case. It's in blue. Well, earlier in the year, it actually was one of the chase cars, the Hot Wheels ID. I rarely talk about this, so hopefully you're uh, you're still here. You get to hear this. GT Hunter. There's the name of the model, and it's, it's you can tr scan it. It has a thing inside for you to scan it. But what's the difference? Look, same wheels. They're both blue, but see the. ID Chase is kind of has Spectra Flame paint on there. As a matter of fact, oh yeah, Spectra Flame paint, same wheels. Uh, unfortunately, it does not have the uh, Hot Wheels ID wheels. Those are pretty cool wheels. I like them. I buy a lot of them, but I just don't talk about them on my channel. Anyways, so that's the difference. It's practically the same car. You wouldn't even notice unless you knew Spectra Flame paint. It has the ID chip on the bottom. This is a regular base. This one, F case. What case did this one appear in? E case. So, uh, was it the last case I pulled this out of? Maybe. I don't remember. I don't keep track. I just do the unboxing, set them to the side, and I got other things to do. While this was, while this was nice, uh, do we have any Mazdas in there? Any Mazdas? Hello? 
Let's do this now too. This is for the people who stuck around. Nope, you're not a Mazda. Maybe, uh, maybe I don't get the Mazda in the case. It might have been in the last case. Anyways, you might have noticed. Hey, look at those wheels. Those are not regular basic wheels. Plus, not only that, look at the red TH right there. <laughs> yeah, this is a super treasure hunt. Pretty cool. And it's on a model that I like to collect. So that's pretty cool. I don't know if the regular one, sometimes a super will have graphics on the top that the basic one doesn't. Uh, I'll, at the end of the video, I'll see if the regular one was, was at, in the last case, and then we'll check that out. Here we go, in white, 67 Camaro. It's the worldwide 67 Camaro. Nice model, it was a uh, real car, shown at SEMA. Uh oh, okay, I got them all. I try to keep all the cars on camera so that you know no funny business going on, right? Love these wheels, fantastic. Love the school wheels, debuted in the Halloween series. There's a, take a peek at the graphics on top, see if we can pause. Very nice deco, HWR cars, lights, lots of decorations. And Rigger Motors actually had a casting change too. It used to have a different thing right here, but sometimes you get an error and that separate piece would be popped off. Love the pink pipes. Very, very nice. Like that release. We've got another Ragin' Express in the case. Now this one, I already picked a couple up off of the pegs. Good, I like it, people like it. This one right here, it's got that color again. You have to think, is that a super treasure? Uh, no, it's just a regular issue. Number 54, race number, graphics on top. And the side, that means nothing in the uh, front and rear. 98 Honda Prelude. Graphics on the top. Mm, it has plastic inserts, by the way, for headlights. It's hard to tell because the, the headlights are tinted, but it sure looks like those are plastic inserts for the uh, headlights. Not inserts. It's probably part of the window. And there's your taillight decorations. Here we have Formula Drift Custom 18. Ford Mustang GT. Seen this on the pigs too. But since I get since I get like three in the cases, because I do the case unboxings, so I take I'll get one or two in one case, and then I'll get one or two in the next. It's like ah, that's enough of that model for me. Now for the Ford GT, I might have bought a few. Here we go. There's that Kia Stinger again. Nice color on the '98 Subaru Impreza. 2222B STI version. STI version. Uh oh, Patty's walking uh, walking under my legs. I don't think she's gonna jump up on the table because to be honest with you, since she had her kittens, she has not been going up very much. She pretty much just likes to stay on the ground. 15 Mazda MX-5 Miata. And sitting behind me is a master case. I still have not unboxed the master case. And when I do the 2020 Master Case, it'll be on Mr. Groove's. Hi, Patty. 98 Subaru Impreza 22B STI. Another one. She broke my concentration. Uh, I think this is the first one out of the case, right? Cosmic Coupe is one of the 2021 new models. For this case, so it has uh, three new models, but all are fantasy, Hot Wheels fantasy cars. That's all right, I'm just saying. Last month, I think, had two, two licensed cars and two fantasy cars. Here is another 20 Jeep Gladiator with those nice stylized graphics. Can we read the fender? Time's up. Oh, bent axles? axles? Oh, not too bad. <laughs> Here you have quad rod. Car de Asada. This was a new model in the last case, and I just seen this. Am I gonna get the one with the retro slot wheels? Please, please, please. Oh, thank you. Love those wheels. Love the retro slot wheels for the mystery machine. In case you like to look at the graphics. There you go, Scooby-Doo. This was a new model last case. So I'll just hold this for a moment, and you gotta pause it, because we gotta move on. I mean, if you if you watch the last case unboxing video, you want to you don't want to have to see it again too long. Here you go, mad props, mad props. Another one, casting change. 
19 convertible ZR1 convertible. Black and white. Has a splitter. You can see the splitter sticking out. So it's not going to be a track car. I don't think it has the adjustable uh, part. Nope. Not going to be a track car. Here's a look at the uh, Corvette wings in the back. Next one. Oh, yeah, we already seen you. Anything special? No errors? No nothing? Nah, I don't see anything. But I hear creaking. Everything's okay. Here we go. Eric and Stein rod. Like this. Like Frankenstein rod. Except it's Eric and Stein rod. I wonder who uh, Eric is. Another Guster Gasser. And 96 Porsche uh, Carrera. I like it. I like it. British green, royal green. Can't get the light on there. It says uh, Carrera right there. I was going to say, I can't say Cayenne. <laughs> Anyways, let's move on. Let's not take too long. Seen everything. Nothing in the back on this one. Side, top graphics. What? what? Oh, no, it's just not straight in the blister. I thought that the grill might be whack. It's okay. It's just not sitting flat in the blister, blister for some reason. Here we go. Uh, 64 Corvette Stingray. Matter of fact, see, this is a re this is a regular white. I don't know if you can tell the difference. This is like a, a pearl white. You might be able to see up uh, when you see this in person. You might be able to see the pearl in the paint. Another Miata. Yep, yep. Seen this on the pegs, but I left it. I, I, I'll get a few. Big Air Bel Air. I like this. I like it very much. He might be doing a gasser thing a bit much, but hey, this is something different. Off-road, just like they did the uh, 914 Porsche. Porsche. They made an off-road version. You know what I just realized? Uh, I thought it was supposed to face that way. But the engines in the front faces that way. See this slope? I thought the car was actually supposed to go this way. Until right now, not only that, big wheels in the back. Usually, not always. Plus, hot wheels face to the right in the package. Most of the time. Sometimes they don't. Trying to think of one that does not face to the right. Doesn't matter. Carte Asada and another bat plane. Graphics on the top. <laughs> another Veloci Racer. I had a story. I just, sorry, I had laughed. Can't tell it. It's not that bad. It's just like, it's something that I would talk on Mr. Groove's, my collector channel. Um, that's all. I got another one of the Cosmic Coupe. And here is Eric and Stein Rod. Another sample. Like that car too. I thought he seen something funny. Odd. Different. Another Formula Drift Mustang. And the last three. Forward Force. Is everybody straight? Yep. Forward Force. There's the graphics on the top. Another Prelude. And... Oh, yeah. i seen this in the pig. I thought, no, no. Oh. It's okay. Sandy Dodge Power Wagon. I don't need a lot of models that are off-road and they don't fit on the track. But I like this. And now it's out in green. Green. Come on, man. Your, your mind says thinks one thing and then your mouth says something else. Thanks a lot. Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to look for a regular, I'm going to look for the regular issue of this Mazda. And uh, I'll see if there's anything that I noticed from the case, any abnormalities or anomalies. Be right back. Okay, thanks for sticking around. Let's wrap this up. So I, what I do is I check every car. I check the base code. I can't, I don't know whether, I didn't check this one. But I checked the base code, make sure they're all the same, make sure there's no funny business. Make sure they're like F code. Sometimes you'll get some E codes. No big deal. It happens. It's not that big a deal. If it, it would be a big deal if like a B case car showed up and I didn't get a super. Why do I have a B card but no super? Did somebody take the super, throw in an old? That's what I'm talking about, right? So only one basic treasure hunt. It was in the case. It's not always in the case. Last uh, code. This was the basic treasure hunt, and it has a circle flame logo right there on Skull Shaker. 
So, no recolors. That's the, oh hi hi Patty. Patty's gonna start casting a shadow, I think. Hi Patty. Hi Patty. I have a separate video for Patty. I'll I'll link to it at the end. Hey wait wait wait! Don't rub, don't rub on the super. You know how cats they like to rub their jaws on like uh, cardboard edges. Boy, I just started. To, I seen her leaning on my super. Say, no, you can't sit there. Oh, this one is last month. This month we had this. Last month we had this. These are rare too. Not in in every case. I don't keep track uh, how often. Oh, the other thing I wanted to say is this was F case. This was actually in the last case, yeah, E case. Uh, you know what? I do the case unboxing video, then I put it away. I just I don't memorize what I get out of each case. This car, this might not seem like something to talk about, but you know we talk about fantasy cars, or at least you know I talk about it. Formula E Generation Two car, Gen Two car. Uh, this might actually be licensed. Look, Formula E. I don't I don't know if that's an official logo. There it is. Look right there. Formula E. So <laughs> this might actually be a licensed model. I don't know. It's just something interesting to pay attention to. I got to try to reach in because Patty's, Patty's sitting right there. Can't, Patty, you're in my way. Oh, last case. I told you I don't memorize it, right? So actually, last case, I did get the mystery machine with the retro slot wheels. So now I have one to open and I have one to keep in the package. If I so choose... Now let's talk about the Super Treasure Hunt. Careful. Has the gold circle flame logo behind the model. It'll have TH. <laughs> She's squeezing in. I like her orange color. And it'll have a TH right there. It's hard to see in red. TH. The regular issue. I don't have one yet. It has a Hot Wheels flame logo. And that regular... She's twitching. You want to be pet, or is, are you twitching because I'm touching you? <laughs> uh, the top, uh, it does have this decoration on the top on the basic as well. Uh, let's give you a little picture real quick. Yeah, so it does have the paint on top, but remember, the regular has uh, basic wheels, has a Hot Wheels flame logo. We already talked about this one. I can set this to the side. I do have a playlist. I was not intending to give you my cat's playlist, but it'd be perfect. Put it right there. Plus, I just filmed one with her and her kittens, if you want to check that out. And I have a playlist with cases where I got a super. Not I only get them like one out of every 15 cases. If you visit the Collector Show in South Pasadena, be sure to say hi. I will be there. Thanks for watching. Happy collecting. Bye-bye.